हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल एंड गुड न्यूज इज दैट आई हैव क्लियर डी पी फाइव हंड्रेड एग्जाम दिस इज द मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट यू नो एग्जाम दैट आई हैव एवर सीन इन माई लाइफ सिंस टू मंथ्स आई वॉज प्रैक्टिसिंग द टेस्ट एंड गोइंग थ्रू यू टी मी कोर्सेज ऑल्सो आई कलेक्टेड द ऑल ऑफ द डॉक्यूमेंट्स फ्रॉम द गूगल एंड एज आई ऑलवेज से दैट आई ऑलवेज प्रिफर टू गो टू द माइक्रोसॉफ्ट डॉट कॉम प्रोफेशनल साइट यू नो डॉक्स डॉट माइक्रोसॉफ्ट डॉट कॉम बट द मोस्ट चैलेंजिंग पार्ट दैट आई फेस to giving this exam was that in this exam uh, i didn't get much dumps as generally we have dumps available in the google site but that is not the case with this uh, tb500 and as the name implement itself like it is a kind of designing and implementing enterprise scale analytic solution using microsoft uh, azure and microsoft power bi so you can understand what is the level of this exam but anyhow i have uh, cleared this exam and i attempted around you know 3 to 4 attempts i have done as i always do at the time of lz 305 also i attempted uh, at least two times so that i have gone through you know uh, kind of questions what kind of question is coming on which topic is more important to uh, get certified so uh, in this video i'm just uh, sharing my experience as how i get cleared in dp 500 and i'm feeling so much happy because uh, this is the most difficult and at one mo moment i thought that no i'm not able to you know clear this exam and last time when i have shared my video at that time i was facing technical issue while giving pearson uh, uh, exam you know I, in that video even i explained each and everything how i feel and how i resolve that uh, issue and at that time my exam was cancelled so anyhow all is well and is well so all is well so i am just giving some overview as uh, hi, how i have gone through the course so first of all i have go to the docs.microsoft.com to get all the you know courses detail and what kind of percentage that i need to prepare for that exam so when i go through the documents uh, in uh, present in uh, microsoft.com then i realize that it is around 25 to 30% is coming from the implement and manage data analytics environment and then uh, i need to know how query and transform a data because in this if you go through my power bi uh, tutorials that i have uh, you know loaded recently there you can learn how we can uh, query a data and then transform a data so uh, because i have already practicing peel 300 i have not gone through the certification but i am just you know reading the how power bi is working and that's why i loaded all of the uh, pdf in youtube video so from there also i got the idea and then how i can implement and manage data models there also i know about uh, because i worked on power bi so from there i got the idea and then explore and visualize data so it is my recommendation do some uh, you know investigation before going to this top exam uh, on the side of pl 300 or power bi or da 100 because da 100 is already you know expiring and now new exam is coming on the place pl 300 where you are going to visualize the data uh, in power bi so you will get the idea how we need to query and how we can transform and how it is looking at the visualize level of the data in your tool so i'm not wasting your time and just uh, giving an overview how much percentage uh, it is coming in the exam so let's start so guys from here i go through this syllabus of dp 500 where even uh, you can download the study guide okay and even they have done an amazing job because i don't require to do anything else apart from you know going through these tutorials like first i have gone through the introduction to data analytics on azure and then i research 
uh, you know questions on the same topic from uh, google and then this is the government i must say around uh, five to six question was from governance data across an enterprise then model query and explore data in azure sipase and then power data for tabular model in power bi then uh, this is the topic design and build tabular uh, model so i can say these are very important topic and you need to cover and if you going to expand you are getting the more topics to learn from this site itself so these are three topic implement advanced data visualization then implement and manage an analytic environment and then manage analytic development life cycle so guys you don't need to do anything more just go through this syllabus and trust me you will crack this exam because these exams seems to be difficult but once you go through this syllabus and some practice test and you understand what is the basic concept behind the power bi and how we can transform the data and query the data, data in your practical way or in your project then it is very easy you to crack this certification and uh, trust me always and always try to do some practice test that you will be getting whenever you are scheduling the exam so from there just practice those tests and you will be easily certified so all the best keep learning and send me your queries if you have any i will try to resolve your all of the query so till then bye bye and take care